If you have ever worked with Let's Trip Studio, you probably know that we have used Apple QuickTime as the main rendering engine for videos. Unfortunately, development of the QuickTime for Windows has now been ceased and it doesn't work 100% of Windows 10 anymore. That's why we have been forced to switch to video rendering engine. And we are now actually happy we did that. The new rendering engine is using Motion JPEG video format. You don't need to worry about it. Let's Trip Studio software converts any type of video file to this supported format automatically. You can even adjust the maximal pixel width and height of the converted video. We recommend to use 720p, but the new rendering engine can handle even Full HD or 4K videos. So what are the new improvements? First of all, the new video format allows us to play the videos faster or slower without any glitches. It's great for live video shows like parties. And the reaction to the speed change is immediate, without any annoying delay. We have also improved the switching between two running videos. Finally, the fade transition is fluent, again without any annoying glitches. But the main benefit of the new video rendering engine is when you are using the videos in your shows. The rendering is precise, no delay when seeking in the show. And you can even define what portion of the video should be used in scene. This is great to cut and use just the parts of the video you like. The practical benefit is the performance. We have done some tests and you can now handle 10 or even more full HD videos running at once in the new software. And the performance benefits are not related to the speed only. The software now doesn't require so much memory, even if you open 100 videos in one workspace. For the new version of Let's Trip Studio, we have basically developed a completely new codec which allows us to play the videos and movies in Windows. It's super fast, saves a lot of memory, and it allows you to play the videos at any speed you want. I would say the Let's Trip Studio is probably the best video player for digital pixel LEDs. <laughs>